our PTA is the heart of the school. You know, everything goes around that. And of course, we want our children to grow up and get lovely exam results. But actually, heart is really what it's about. Heart is where we function best. Heart is where we prove that we can role model heart to our children. Our children then grow up with a bit of heart. For many, the PTA is a conduit through which our thoughts, our thoughts, our hopes, our aspirations for our children can actually be realised because we can express them to people who are going to engage in order to fulfil them because they're their thoughts, their hopes and their aspirations as well. And that's community. When the PTA comes in and speaks, they know that they're not just speaking on behalf of that group, they're speaking on behalf and have been enabled to speak on behalf of every parent. Well, I think the main reason that you know PTAs are so inspirational, and, and coming down here uh, to this award ceremony today and actually seeing some of the fine work that volunteers are doing up and down the country is, is really eye-opening for a head teacher in a secondary school in a difficult area where motivating parents is, is, is difficult enough. It's opened my eyes to the fact that people need to support the work of their schools, because schools work often in isolation, and these schools that we're celebrating today are absolute epitomes of what can be achieved when people pull together. But I would love to see the PTA empowered to an even greater level, to have even greater influence on, on the educational policy makers. That would be like you'd then have the whole thing sewn up. There's a great dream that's represented in the American Constitution that Abraham Lincoln quoted in the Gettysburg Address, which is about the representation of the people for the people, by the people. It's a great dream, it's a great ideal, but actually it is best embodied in the PTA and more embodied in PTAs than in any other organization or body that I am aware of anywhere. Because you are us and you are for us and you act on our behalf. And if that isn't for the people, of the people, by the people, I don't know what is.